Speaker. Um, I'd like to thank the chair and the ranking member for working with me to include a proposal in this bill that I developed with Congresswoman Black, Congressman Thompson, and Congressman Nehan, modernizing Medicare and harnessing the promise of telehealth to improve care for patients nationwide. Allowing patients with end-stage renal disease to receive dialysis at home can dramatically improve their health outcomes and quality of life. This is something I've heard consistently from providers in my home state of Washington, like the Northwest Kidney Centers, who do incredible work to help patients receive dialysis at home when it's medically appropriate. Advances in telehealth hold great potential to extend this treatment uh, to extend this treatment option to more Americans, particularly in rural communities. But there are still too many barriers to the use of cutting edge technologies in Medicare. There's a great need to update our laws to reflect these innovations and reimburse telehealth appropriately. Otherwise, we won't just be denying access to healthcare today. We could be preventing the next frontier of innovations from even getting off the ground. Without the long-term visibility of Medicare coverage, startups and entrepreneurs might never get the funding they need to develop new technologies and bring them to market. It's essential that we unlock the full potential of telehealth. By doing so, we can improve patient care, promote health, defeat heartbreaking diseases, and save lives. That's why I'm so glad we're taking this step today. Thank you again to the committee for working with me on this important bill, and I hope it's the first of many victories as we work together to expand telehealth. I urge my colleagues to vote yes, and I yield back. Gentlemen.